Hey, today I'm gonna show you how to use PVC pipes to make a siphon to drain your pond. You may be like me and you got a pond that's overflowing and washing your dam away. Can't get my spillway clear. Uh, easiest way is to build a siphon. I'm gonna get a big piece of corrugated pipe, dig me a ditch, run it straight through the dam. Like a new spillway. So you can see that feeds to my creek back there. The old spillway, about 10 feet out. Can't even see it because the water level is too high. So I can zoom in on it. It's a chimney type. It's clogged up. This pond's pretty nasty. Need to clean it too. All right, so basically what we got, we got PVC, some four inch PVC, down in the water, running across the dam to a T, then down the other side of the dam to the spillway to the creek. So what you do is you backfill the pipe leading away from the dam, away from the pond, through the T. Once you get it up to the top of the dam, to the T, screw the cap back on, and you cut your bag that you have duct tape at the bottom of the PVC pipe. The suction created from the water rushing out up to the point of the T creates a vacuum. All right, so we're ready to cut the bag and get the siphon going. So there's a quick recap, got a 45, Connecting one single piece, four inch PVC, going down into the pond. Got another piece connected to my T. Got the water level filled up to the top of, or to the T, to the top of the bank. At this point, any excess water I pour in, I'm just running back into the pond. So anyway, go to the bottom of the hill. I got two pieces of P two pieces of PVC connected there to get me all the way to the bottom. Cut the plastic bag that I have duct taped on the end. From the water flowing out of the end to the T creates a suction. That's going to get the siphon going, and it'll just keep draining and draining, gravity fed, until the water level gets low enough for it to cut off. All right, so let's get it. All right, here we go. Got it flowing. Flowing good. That's all there is to it, folks. 